I'm here with the winner, Derek Lewis. Derek, why'd you take your pants off? Yeah, my balls was hot. I understand. Welcome back to Snap Talks MMA. So, we here, UFC 247. And we got to go through the main car leading up to the main event, John Jones and Dominic Reyes. So, the fight that I'm going to get my prediction on is the first fight that's on the main card, which is Derek Lewis versus Aria Latifa. Now, it's going to be an interesting fight. I only say that because, I mean, Latifi hasn't been to heavyweight since 2008. Well, he um, only fought light heavyweight from those two, three fights he had um, as a heavyweight when he first started out. Now, his background, if you didn't know, he's, he is a wrestler, um, Armenian descent. You know, his brother also was um, a wrestler, and he fights out of America top team. Now, we all know that America top team out there in Florida got some of the best top-notch guys and girls out there that's fighting. They got Woodley and uh, Covington. They got Amanda Nunes and Joanna Jacek. You know, they got some fighters out there, uh, Diamond Portier. So, um, also, they got Junior Dos Santos. Now, the reason I bring up Junior Dos Santos right now is the fact that, well, he fought Derrick Lewis, you know, not that long ago. And then they fight, he ended up beating Lewis, TKO, by, you know, those body shots really took a toll on him. And uh, another thing that Dos Santos was doing is, you know, trying to avoid that power. Now, he had throw a punch or he'd get snuck, you know, by a punch by Derrick Lewis, and then he returned the punch. Very interesting when you think about it. So I don't know, but uh, in this fight, this could be a little bit different. See, we haven't seen Latifi fight heavyweight, but not in the UFC anyway. But it could be real interesting. So he wants a challenge. He want to move up and wait. But I think he's a little too small for Derrick Lewis. So he'll probably come in. You know, one, he's 5'9", five, 5'10", five, a smaller guy. Yes, he has, you know, great wrestling and everything. But he will come in about 5'10", you know, that's his regular height. But his weight somewhere around 230. Well, Derrick Lewis will come in at about 265, you know, at the max, at the limit. But on fight night, he probably will weigh about 275, you know, 274. I think you, the max that you get is like eight over um, on fight night after they weigh you just because of the, you know, everything else that's going on. So... Uh, I think the fight is going to be interesting. So one thing I think Latifi should do, obviously, is body shots. The body shots could be his key to victory. Um, wrestling, key to victory. Avoid Derrick Lewis power. That's another key to victory. You know, one thing I heard Derrick Lewis say in his interview about his back, we already know about his back issues, but he mentioned about his knees. Well, if I'm Latifi and I'm looking at any of these interviews or a coach or anybody, then I know that I'm going to have to go ahead and attack his knees, which means that my whole goal is to, from belly button down, that's where I'm attacking. And avoid his power, stay on him, don't get in uh, compromising positions, because as we all know, what happens is you get in a, a compromising position with Derrick Lewis, he can get out of the position. Now, I seen Chael Sutton say today or yesterday, talking about if Derrick Lewis is on his back and you happen to get him a side control, it's not advantageous for you because of how Derrick Lewis fights. Um, so i give you an example. I'll show you a little clip of the things that Derrick Lewis does to escape, um, you know, those different mounted situations. It's, it's either side control, a back mount. He does something really interesting when you're watching him. When he, you have back back control and one thing we know that you don't really have back mount or control unless you got one his stomach got to be on the mat and two you got to make sure that you got control of his hips what Derek lewis likes to do is get up on all fours you know which changes the, the amount of pressure you can get on his hips so that you can't really just like you can't i mean you could you could try and sink some hooks in but 
it's not going to work just because of the position that, that Derrick Lewis, Derek Lewis uses when he gets up. But you guys check out the clip. Tell me what you think about some of the escapes of Derrick Lewis, and then we continue the video. So as you can see, Derek, Derek Lewis is a very interesting guy. You know, he gets up out of all the wrong positions, but all the right positions at the same time. You know, he makes sure he controls your elbow. He makes sure he controls um, your wrists, your arms. Um, he it shows that he's really strong, you know, really a really strong guy also. Um, when Big Country Roy Nelson was on top of him in the almost crucifix position. It was just amazing to see that he just pretty much just lifted Roy off of him, all 265 pounds of Big Roy Country Nelson off of him with pretty much one arm, which is pretty darn amazing. So um, when I break down the fight more, I think it will come down to you know, who's going to land first. I think Derrick Lewis has a pretty solid chin. I think he'll end up winning the fight. I think he'll knock out Latifi um, in the second round. It didn't get past the first round because Latifi's going to try to wrestle him a little bit. I think he's going to get tired. I don't think his cardio is going to be good as a heavyweight compared to his light heavyweight campaign. So I think he'll get knocked out in the second round. Um, I'm expecting the overhand right by Derrick Lewis. Now, Junior Dos Santos in this fight against Derrick Lewis used a, um, like a fake takedown to overhand. And I'm pretty sure Latifi and those guys at the American Top Team is going to utilize that strategy is to change levels on Derrick Lewis and eventually try to catch him with an overhand. I know he could do the, the belly button down attacks, which I think is the best strategy, but I think that when I really look at everything and kept looking at everything, yeah, Latifi is probably going to try to go for a, a fake takedown, come over the top, and see if he can catch um, Derrick Lewis just like Junior did. But I think Derrick Lewis is going to be prepared for that, and I think he's going to win the fight. But you guys let me know what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. We got more videos coming. Um, we got four other fights left on that main card. That we got to talk about, obviously, the number one is John Jones and Dominic Reyes. You know, we got to talk about Valentina against um, Caitlin Sh Shukagan. You know, I got to make sure I say that name correctly. Um, but, hey, stay tuned. I got more videos coming. Appreciate you. Till next one.